hello uh, very good morning welcome to dot programming dot blogspot.com today i will show you uh, how to validate a debit card uh, like a debit card number expiry and cvv in esp.net c-sharp so first of all uh, design structure of uh, your debit card uh, in that manner enter card number uh, enter expiry uh, in this tutorial I will show you a simple example of a debit card demo so uh, I want to take a card number in 16 digit uh, so you can enter only digits uh, in place of characters in the expiry uh, you can enter only uh, the valid date okay uh, and valid year and in CVV you can put only three digits just uh, which is just back side of your uh, debit card so that all these things I will do using regular expression validator because a regular expression is used to here so first of all add a required field validator control in front of all three fields okay now set the required field properties uh, like turn code control to validate uh, four color text etc also set the group name uh, validation group if you want to okay now after that uh, the man logic in the regular expression actually um, the square brackets is used uh, in the regular expression is used for uh, from to two I mean to say uh, I want to put the numbers 0 to 9 in the text box so square bracket is used for 0 to 9 just like uh, small characters and capital characters so small character uh, just you can take s and backslash s s for the small character and backslash s the separated for both characters in the square brackets okay also you can use or symbol uh, uh, which is used in the c okay simply uh, the square brackets is used the characters a to z and 0 to z also you can use the uh, braces uh, um, in the functions uh, brackets you can use in this regular expressions for your multiplications of the number actually and concat the number okay so uh, let's check uh, that validations here so please enter in the 16 digits in the first and that uh, in the second I will use another that means of uh, uh, square, double square bracket 0 okay 1 to 9 it means uh, your you can put 1 to 9 digits and 0 for your month name okay 0 to 1 to 9 etc as you want to concat with this number also you can use 0 1 and 1 with the concat with the any other numbers okay 1 concat with the 0 to 2 okay uh, like uh, month you can enter in it uh, 12 so you can concat with the 0 to 2 only 1 and 2 so month is 12 only 0 1 0 2 0 3 and 10 is used to here so 0 to 2 uh, so or symbol and the or that's uh, that's is concept for the year so minimum year is 2009 and again here is braces with the two zero and sectors so that's 
put in the validation expression and validation group also provide this also change the text yeah please enter correct format or you can say the card expiry format correct format that is mm and four times of five by by okay that's fine okay now uh, in the uh, cvv you can enter okay so also in the cvv we can add minimum three digits and maximum three digits so replace the 16 to 16 with the three to three and in the square brackets used backslash t only for the digits okay now run this and check your output on your browser uh, it's taking few seconds to load your output on your browser so learn how to uh, create a, a regular expression for your so first of all button click required field validator is used card number first to enter 16 correct digits and with the uh, digits also so that is not valid please enter 16 digits only so remove this and enter 17 digits or less than 17 is not valid mm, 9012345 that is 16 digits and 17 it's not valid 16 it's valid okay now enter card expiry uh, what expiry is mmddyy uh, four times of yy so i will uh, put uh, false value in it like 0 4 and here is 13 it's not a valid mm 4 times of i i mean to 2013 is correct cvv is 4 5 6 7 it's not valid only three digits is valid so that's fine thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial please keep watching my all other video tutorials thank you thank you very much